The three sacred mosques and the cities in which they stand, Mecca, Medina, and Jerusalem, which you have been watching during this film, have witnessed significant events in the history of Islam. The Hadith say that many significant events that will take place in the end times and make their mark on history will happen in the region containing these three mosques. It is narrated that the Mahdi, peace be upon him, will receive the oath of allegiance in Mecca and will migrate to Jerusalem. The Mahdi from the line of Fatima will appear in Mecca and people will swear allegiance to him against his wishes. He, the Mahdi, will migrate to Jerusalem. The Mahdi will remain fourteen years in Jerusalem. The Prophet Jesus will meet up with the Mahdi in Jerusalem and they will perform the prayer together. The Messenger of God said, Jesus, son of Mary, would then descend in Jerusalem, and their commander would invite him to come and lead them in prayer. But he would say, No, some amongst you are commanders over some others. When the Mahdi is performing the morning prayer with the faithful at the Bayt al-Mahdis, Jesus, son of Mary, will appear, and the prophet Jesus will place his hands on his shoulder and say, the call to the prayer has been issued for you, so you must lead it. And finally, the Mahdi will lead the Prophet Jesus and the faithful in prayer. The Antichrist will try to enter Mecca and Medina, but will fail and will be defeated by the Prophet Jesus somewhere near Jerusalem. The Antichrist will come from the eastern side with the intention of attacking Medina until he will get down behind Uhud. Then the angels will turn his face towards Syria and there he will perish. He, Jesus, would then search for him, the Antichrist, until he would catch hold of him at the gate of Lut and make him ineffective. It appears from the Hadith that the three blessed cities of Mecca, Medina, and Jerusalem that house the three holy mosques, the Great Mosque, the Prophet's Mosque, and the Al-Aqsa Mosque, will be the centers of important events in the end times, just as they have been in the past. Muslims will witness this joyful age, many signs of which are already coming about. Almighty God knows the truth, of course.